Hello folks. My name's Ross. This is Rail Route, the train dispatching game. I, uh, I like to play the timetable game mode and I like to choose some difficult maps and attempt to solve them without pausing the game and without making any mistakes. Uh, this is um, this was made by Stargirl, uh, one of my favorite uh, map authors. Um, can be a little tricky. It's uh, uh, set in um, uh, you can see right here, uh, it's 1990. What do you honestly think? There are no auto signals. So, I guess we'll just get started. I'm going to set up my, uh, my sinks as auto accept. And 9N01 needs to get all the way to Blackfriars 2. And at this point, I also want to set up all of my auto reverses. Let's see if I remember every little trick that comes this way. And there are a handful of trains that have to get to and from London Bridge in order to get over to Blackfriars Station, but uh, you'll find that um, this is going to be a bit of a bottleneck, this uh, transfer track over. And that's what this all is, is lots of manual switches. You're going to find a lot of log jamming right around this switch. And that's uh, that's what makes you pull your hair out playing this this map. Alright, and 3C01 needs to get up to this set of tracks in order to get into Blackfriars 1, I think. Yes. Okay, uh, 5C01 is um, one of the first wrinkles that you have to deal with. you got to get this all the way up to the carriage sightings. Oh, I thought... I think you stopped. <laughs> 9A01 dropping down to the fifth platform. Looks like we timed that decently so they don't have to stop. There is no uh, penalty for slowdowns. Thank goodness. Alright, now 5C01 is woken up and 2X01, another one coming from London Bridge, needs to jump on over. Um, this map you're going to have a lot of uh, waiting at these signals as uh, you know, platforms get cleared um, and it can be a little nerve-wracking if you're not used to hearing all of those uh, warning noises. Okay, 
getting anything prepared for uh, 9B01 to head out to Elephant Castle 3. Now the line should be cleared to get this uh, 5C01 into Platform 1. Oh my goodness. Okay, now you're going to be playing a game called Hurry Up and Wait. 2x01 is going to come in to uh, this signal. Uh, it's, uh, sorry, stop at this signal while they're waiting for the log jam at Blackfriars uh, Bay platforms to clear out. Right, and there's 3C01 looking to clear out, but... Oh, it is 80. 40 miles an hour. Uh, kilometers, excuse me. Using freedom units, I apologize. And here's our next wrinkle, 3E01. This one needs to get to carriage sightings number one, but that doesn't happen until 5C01 gets reversed and exits the platform. So I'll have 3E01 stop at this signal. the dance begin. Um, over here with Holborn Viaduct I find that uh, incoming on platform 2 from the low level that uh, this auto block uh, is where there's an important hold. And that's finally clear. Next thing I'll do is tuck 3E01 up the next couple tra uh, 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 tracks, excuse me. Two S zero one to platform five, and then we got to get things ready for nine N zero one, which we'll have to wait until two X zero one is clear. Yeah. 
Yes, yes, you all have to wait. <laughs> if I recall correctly, I bring 2G01 down first. And 5C012 Cannon Street. That'll be a little funky. 2Z02 out. 2S01 to low level. Forgot about my train in the auto block. Alright, since there's some cross cross action here with the with the diamond crossing, I'm gonna send uh Yeah, two zero zero one out first and hold two H zero one in the auto block. It's just kind of this paranoia, you know, that you're forgetting something. Did you forget to reverse a train? You know, is that an anticipated hold signal? You know. Okay, I think I got it. Go, go, go. Once again, forgetting about trains and auto blocks. Yeah, I'm going to take uh, two W01 and then transfer them up to the uh, platform one track after they get out to here. To 3C01 to Cannon Street. Now, 2G01 claims, um, you know, you can use any platform. We all know how true that is. <laughs> so let's actually take a look at the timetable here. And... It looks as though as if Platform 5 uh, is going to be needing to be occupied at 8.23. And this is going to cross that, so this uh, 2G01 needs to be on Platform 4.
2001, headed to London Bridge. We'll get that set up. Reverse this and get this ready. This is going to be a little bit of dancing. Actually starting to lose my composure here a little bit. If I recall correctly, I want to push 2001 all the way through for London Bridge because it's got to it's got to get to that platform by 8:25. But I will sneak 3E01 in front of 9N05. to D01 to platform 5. Forgot about that. This is platform 4. There we go. I wonder if this was a mistake here, trying to weave uh, 3E01 through there. Please go faster than 40 kilometers an hour.
All right, that's through. Looks like uh, 24 made it and 25 will as well. That's cleared up. Let's get this cleared up. Two zero three, uh, uh, two Z zero three into platform three. Again, only nineteen trains left. To navigate through this, I can get you up there. So two N O three into the auto block. This is heading to Platform 3, Elephant Castle at 833. This is heading to London Bridge. Okay. I think I can get a little funky with 2G01. Because I need to get 9N06 quickly into platform 2. 
But I have a clear enough line to pull this off. Go ahead, reverse 2x01. Um, so once these lines clear, I'll show you what I'm going to do. The temptation would be to send London Bridge 4 up to this line, but again, this is this is the bottleneck of the whole area. So I'm actually going to send it straight. And this definitely requires a little bit of work. All the way up there. Uh, we will need to be diligent with 2x01. Um, I believe this one makes it just in time. Yeah, because this, the block signal that I had set up for uh, 2g01 uh, keeps all of that path occupied. And I choose to send Elephant Castle on this line uh, and then transfer up so that I can have room for 2z03 to get up here to go to Cannon Street.
Uh, I was looking for this one. Elephant and Castle 3, 2901 hits the platform at 842. 2N01 hits the platform at 840. The temptation is to put 9N06 in front. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to leave that high. I'm going to leave 2N01 low. And that'll do a transfer over here. Alright, whole bunch of hurry up and wait. Pretty certain with how clear everything is that I can just route the entirety of this one out. Up to London Bridge. And I'll just manage these. We'll just speed it up to the end. And there you have it. Holborn Viaduct. 100%. No pause. Thanks for watching.